Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make this retro starburst effect in Illustrator CC. So let's get started. I'm going to begin by selecting the polygon tool right over here and making a triangle by just clicking on the board, switching the sides to three and pressing OK. Then I'm going to select the triangle and I'm going to stretch it out. So it's about yay long. After that, select your triangle, go to effect Go to Warp and go to Arc. Here, make sure that your arc is set on vertical and not horizontal. No look like that. And I want the arc not to be too crazy, not something like this, but maybe I'll do something like 20%. Press OK. Having done that with your object selected, go to Object and Expand Appearance. Good. Now, select your object, press R, and hold Alt and click just at the tip of it. This screen will pop up and what you want to do here is type 360 divided by the amount of times that you want this shape to appear in a circle. So in this case, I want it to appear 20 times. So I just go 360 divided by 20 and then press copy. And then to repeat it, just press command or control D or you can hold it. And now I have 20 instances around a perfect circle. Perfect. Then I'm just going to color every second one. This. There we go. Perfect. I'm going to move these boxes away because now we're going to select our entire shape, hold shift and make it bigger. So it encompasses the entire screen. Okay. Now we can modify this a bit by just zooming in, pressing control Y and dragging, ah, oh, sorry, control Y, and then holding or pressing A, which is your direct select key, and then selecting the center like that. I can press control Y right now. Now I can move the center and you see it curves everything. So it creates kind of different effect. It looks a bit more interesting if you pull it down to one of the colors, corners than if you just have it right in the middle. It's an easy way of modifying it. Now to make the background color, we don't have to color this area in between. It's quite simple. We just press M, draw a rectangle all the way to here. Give it the color that you want, your third color. It's gonna be yellow here. I'm gonna right click and go arrange, send to the back. Now we've colored that area, perfect. And then we just wanna clip this whole area, the square. We do that by drawing a rectangle over our entire shape, like that. Then selecting all of our shapes and going right click and make clipping mask. There you go. And now you have a retro starburst, pa starburst pattern. It's that simple. So if you have any questions, write them in the comments below. Hit like, subscribe, check out our other videos, of course. As always, have a great day.